All right, everybody, it's time for Saturday Stockman Stampede. This is an open tag. It was started by Terry's Knives and Man Stuff, and he put his video out earlier today. And I was like, man, that knife looks familiar, and I just got one of those in the mail. Um, got me a new 75 here. Everyone knows the large Stockman is known as the 75, but Amber Bone Peach Seed Jig Large Stockman, as you can see, 6375 carbon steel. Now, for me to buy a case knife, it's got to be in carbon steel. If it's not in carbon steel, it's got to be something a little special for me to kind of look at it and want to buy it. Um, but, you know, I've got a, another one of these. This is the Smoky Valley Sunset. Let's show the show side here. It's carbon 1095, but this is a user. I bought this thing to kind of use and uh, put some patina on and I started using it. And, man, it, uh, it's been serving me well. So I thought, why not get a second one just to keep around as kind of a, a good piece. And I got a kind of a smoking deal on this one here. Um, you guys know me and Doom Crew, or we talk all the time, and he puts out videos on how he buys his case knives. And, uh, you know, you just put in a generic search on eBay, and I did that and uh, came across this one here. And uh, the buy now price was pretty cheap, and then they had best offers. So I threw out an offer, uh, I think $48. He came back at $53, and I came back at $49, and he came back at $50. $50. And then I was like, well, that's not good enough. And I tried again, and he went up to $51. And then I was like, I threw out an offer of $50, and he took it. So all in all, I got this knife right here for $58, and I believe they sell it. I, I believe for $84 on smoke on the SMKW or Shepherd Hills. Now we got a little gappage right here, but that don't bother me. You know, I've got $58 total in this knife and I'm pretty pleased with it. Um, you know, let's just open her up here and kind of see, see what it looks like. We got your case. We got four dots. That means it's a 2022. And again, it is the carbon steel. And I haven't even really oiled the pivots on these, but there's our Tang stamp, USA 6375 CS. And this sheep's foot blade. These sheep's foot blades on these puppies are just, they're monsters. And you can do perfect draw cuts with these. And, you know, the grinding ain't too bad on this one either. You know, you're... Your overall like edge looks pretty even you know again we can't see it perfectly the light ain't the best in this room but it's the only place I really got anymore to come and shoot these videos and on this tank stamp you got the CS for carbon steel on your sheep on your uh, spade blade so yeah and of course we got a shield here just your regular case double X shield and if you carry these long enough, those will pop out. So always have that in the back of your head that those are eventually just going to pop out. But let's look at the, the jigging on this. Pretty good jigging. You know. Again, we got our gap right here. But, you know, again, a case knife of this caliber, these are what, four and a quarter inches? Let's put her down here on the seven. It goes to 11 and a quarter, so these are four and a quarter inches long. Large, you know, these are fairly larger knives, and these are just to get work done. These are big working blades, big working knives. And of course, you use them, you're going to get a nice, nice patina on these. So let's look at the jigging here on the show side. Yeah, looks pretty good. And, you know, get your dark in the middle and it goes out to this nice uh, off-white here towards your bolsters. We do got smooth transition into your bolsters. You don't feel the pins sticking up or anything. You know, and, of course, your your uh, sheep's foot blade is going to have a cant to it because this is just a two-spring knife. So the middle blade's got a cant to it to kind of sit in between those. And these usually get some blade rub on them, on these three bladed knives that have the cant. But if this one does have it, it would be, it's going to be very minimal. I don't really see it. 
here on the sheep's foot. Oh, there's some right there on the top. I don't know. Yeah, it's probably from pulling. If it's on that side, it's from pulling this this blade here, your your main clip point up out of there. It's rubbing on it. But, you know, you're definitely going to get blade rub on these. Just it is something that's going to happen. So you just got to have that in the back of your mind. And, of course, these don't come all the way finished on the edge. You can actually feel the burr. So all you got to do is kind of hit that with a nice uh, Arkansas stone and then strop it and she'll be razor sharp, sharp for you. Yeah, guys, I don't want to take too long on this video. It's just a, just my response to Terry's Knives and Man Stuff Open Tag. Again, there's your box that comes in. I always keep all my boxes. I don't throw them away. Remember, it's going to cause some cancer or reproductive harm. I don't know how, but... Well, that's a good looking... That's a good looking logo right there, ain't it? And then you got the Made in the USA up here. That's why I love boxes. Boxes just tell you a little bit about the knife. Just tells you a little bit about it. Again, I got my cigar from Doom Crew. Well, let's put this other 75 up here. This Man, this thing right here has just been... She's been beat on, boys. She's definitely been beat on. But I want to show you guys something. You guys know we're doing the month-long raffle for Happy Hour Live Chat. And we're going to have the drawing tomorrow. So if you entered the raffle to win the Kaiser Roach, you're going to have a raffle ticket. And here are the raffle tickets I made. There's, And trust me, there's a lot in there because... I cut each of the, each of these out and folded them. I double folded them, and then we'll have Sarah come in tomorrow and uh, draw for that. But be sure you hop on tomorrow, 5.30 Eastern, 4.30 Central, and we'll be doing a drawing play in the first 10 or 15 minutes of that. And then we'll start our November or October breast cancer awareness raffles. And we're going to change that up a little bit because we got enough to give away a, a pink item every week. So we're going to have a drawing every week, I believe, for uh, a pink item for breast cancer awareness. But... This is who, someone's going to win this one tomorrow out of that, out of those raffle tickets. Now, do you guys, I'm going to show you guys what, uh, you carry something like this in. Terry's Dyes and Man Stuff was talking about these uh, pancake belt sheaths. And this is uh, one I got, EDC Leatherworks sent this to me. So, this is what you want to use to carry one of these bad puppies down in. She'll sit right on your hip and it'll be ready to pull out and use, guys. All right. Don't forget, tune in tomorrow, and be sure you go over and uh, hop on Terry's Knives and Man Stuff. He's uh, got some great content. He started this open tag, so I figured I'd get on here and just shoot me a little quick video with my phone and kind of kind of do my own 75 video for Stockman Saturday, Stockman Stampede. All right, guys. Hey, stay sharp and stay strong out there.